I'm Kim Anderson and this is Tailgate Talk on SunUp's Market Monitor. If you're wondering where the tailgate is, it's in the shop. Producers are going to be top dressing wheat over the next few weeks. There's some decisions that they need to make when you to determine whether to top dress or not and how much nitrogen to apply. Producers need to know the price of wheat, the price of the nitrogen, on the particular farm or plot, they need to know the potential yield. They need to have their target yield. Now there's market risk and there's yield risk in this decision process. To get the price of wheat, call your local elevator and see what they're forward contracting for harvest delivery. If you go to Northern Oklahoma, Pond Creek, Medford, that area, it's about $5.50 a bushel. Go down in Southern Oklahoma, Snyder, Altus, take off about 30 cents or $5.20. Go up to I-40, Weatherford, it's about $5.30. Now there's price risk there, and I've got the bottom on the prices around $4.75 for Northern Oklahoma, and the top at around $6.50. If you're looking at fertilizer prices, call your local uh, fertilizer dealer. I called around, and nitrogen cost, oh, just under 60 cents a bushel. Now Dr. Arnell tells me that the price of uh, or that it takes about two pounds of nitrogen for each bushel of wheat. So that's about $1.20 a bushel. So first off, you gotta figure out for a field is what's the potential yield, and then do you want to top dress or not? If you're gonna to top dress, what's the target yield? Now you can visit with your county agent, or your, Dr. Arnold, if you don't know how to calculate those, I know uh, they'll talk about green strips or maybe soil testing, but you've got to have your potential yield and your target yield. And let's say your potential yield is 30 bushels, your target yield is 40 bushels. That means I'm gonna need about 20 pounds of nitrogen to pick up that 10 bushels. Remember that every decision you make is an economic decision. You want a decision that's gonna generate more profit. So you wanna make decisions that are normally right and avoid decisions that are normally wrong. And you can normally get to that uh, answer by pushing a pencil and making calculations. I'll see you next week on SunUp's Market Monitor.